Right, so let's install Docker. This is really straightforward. The Docker project actually provide a, a script, which we can go and take a quick look at, which uh, does a bunch of stuff under the hood. <clears throat> you absolutely must not pipe stuff to shell uh, as root. So when I say pipe, that means this. So what this command does is it downloads this script and then it pipes it to your shell and executes the commands in the script, probably as root, uh, if that's what you're running this curl command as, which you probably need to, given the fact it's installing packages on your system. So, as I say here, it's uh, a huge security risk. Don't just blindly copy and paste stuff from random websites, like this one, <laughs> as root. It's fine, um, probably in this case, because it's from Docker not my website directly but if you are uncomfortable go look at the script go download the script and put it onto your system manually and run it that way if you're uncomfortable doing this so let's get started let's install curl first of all because debian for some reason doesn't ship with curl installed and then we'll use curl to actually install docker so let's do that now this is quite uh well, it's fully automated, so you just have to sit back and watch as the script executes. So I'm going to speed things up whilst it does it. Marvellous. All right, so that's now done. Uh, the last thing to do, I think, before we do anything else is to add your user to the Docker group. Uh, the command's also printed out for you here. Uh, this is considered a bit of a security hole because giving um, a normal user access to Docker without having to sudo or change as root basically means that there is there are some privilege escalations that you can perform as this user to become root effectively. It's a bit of, it's a, bit of a security hole. My general attitude is at home, we're not building a bank, so it will probably be fine. And uh, again, it's up to you whether you choose to do this step or not. Now, let's just double check that the um, Docker daemon is running with systemctl status. Docker, great. Green, I like green. This means things are working. And then um, just a quick demo container, we'll do uh, docker run dash dash rm so it deletes when it's completed hello world pulls the image from docker hub it's tiny a megabyte or so uh, and the fact that this has been printed out hello this message shows that your installation appears to be working correctly and because we passed dash dash rm and there's nothing left behind there will be an image so we can just delete that with <laughs> look at that not even two kilobytes docker rmi uh, and then i'll use the image id here it's gone. Okay, so Docker is now installed.